this round is a decent example of look at how brilliant and beautiful the color is imagine what this would look like if it was a brand new rebuilt or brand new new old stock CRT these roundy sets even though they're from the mid 60s especially the RCA but I'll tell you this one's keeping right up with RCA these sets have the potential to produce a really good picture really good color of course the definition is not there but the color and the overall picture is very watchable I mean, look at what we did to this set it was sort of minimal you know Johnny Bacchus takes a close look at our spike here in California Los Angeles County now has the highest number of COVID-19 cases in the country but it's Imperial County east of San Diego that the governor is recommending reinstate stay-at-home orders if they uh, are not uh, able to come to some consensus uh, I am committed to intervening it has the highest test positivity rate in the state, averaging 23% compared to 5.7% statewide. This has the Zenith Buzzomatic detector, too. We're going to have to dial it back because of what we see with the data. Late Friday, a federal judge in Los Angeles ordered the Trump administration to release detained migrant children over COVID 19 concerns, warning that family centers are on fire. Arizona is also dealing with one of the worst spikes in the country. Saturday, the number of cases increased again by more than 3,500. ICUs there are nearing maximum capacity. We are doing everything that we can to run on bare bones. Melanie Nunga Ray Ortiz is a nurse at Banner University Hospital. And the reason why I use the, new, the news is it doesn't trigger the content ID copyright thing. So all in all, this set is really performing very well. Very well. I mean, the picture is not a lot of noise. I might have the color up a little bit too high, but I can bring that down. Let's see. There we go. Joining United and making all seats available. Don Ubacus, KCAL 9 News. The Trump administration insists the curve is flattening even as coronavirus cases increase in many parts of the country. Correspondent Nicole Killian tells us more about the message.